Hello everyone, this is Dana Talbert, and today we will be looking at a fire tribe Agori. So, um, unlike some of my other builds, this isn't meant to be. <clears throat> this is sort of a revamp of, um, of an actual official set, but it's not supposed to be that official set. It's supposed to just be a generic villager. It's not supposed to be any specific character. But here, uh, here he is. It's a pretty simple build. I don't really like how the arms are constructed. Um, and honestly, this is probably one of the builds where I might end up changing like revamping it again sometime in the future but for now this is my agori build um in my scale so now um give you a quick spin around i did cover the back anyway now let's go over our articulation so far articulation it's got a ball joint at the head it's got ball jointed shoulders a very limited hinge at the elbow, and a very limited hinge at the wrist. Um, oh, that part fell off there. And then for the legs, it's got a ball joint hip, ball joint knee, and then a ankle tilt. So that about does it for my agori. And to give you a little sneak peek at next week, episode let me grab malum the former prime glatorian of the fire tribe at least in the uh, original universe he's the former prime glatorian of the fire tribe um i haven't really decided much of this fierce magna lore in my universe um in fact i um that's where i started writing like like actually writing a story and more, and I haven't worked on that in forever. But for now, um, that's just an idea of how a Glatorian looks next to an Agori. And this is about the same height as the other two Glatorian I've reviewed on this channel. So yeah, it's about the same height as Strax and my self mock. So yeah, that about does it for this video, and I will see you all next week when we take a look at this big guy.